What's up friends today we will make curtain in 3ds max, let's start with making plane in front view. Now give length and width segments to 12, this will give smoothness to curtain. We go to modify and select wave. Increase amplitude 1 and amplitude 2, this will give you wave like shape. To maximize the viewport simply hold ALT and W key, rotate the plane to see the waves in the plane, you can also change the color of the curtain. You can take any color, I take pink color, it's attractive. You can see the waves are created in the shape. To look around the shape, simply hold ALT and mouse wheel and move around. You can also take my readings. Now change the value of wavelength. We can see the waves but they are not smooth, we will do it later on. Go to modify and select FFD box. Go to set number of points, in length and width change value to 13. It will look like this. Go to front view. Click on control points from modify panel, by pressing control key, select first column leave the three column, select fifth column, again leave three column, select the ninth column, at last select thirteenth column, now select scale option and simply drag and drop down the points, like this, select move option and move all the points, in an upward direction, press W key to move all the points. Select these three column. Move these columns in downward direction like this. If you wanna animate the curtain like cloth is moving, it can also be done by using auto key, we will discuss later on. Go to modify and select turbo smooth A, change the attrition to the value 2. The reason behind using Turbo Smooth is to smooth in the edges to look good, it will also give realistic view without using any material. You can also use material from the material library, just press M key and apply the texture of cloth you like. To give the thickness to the curtain select shell from modify panel. Change the inner amount and outer amount. Shell command is basically used to give the thickness in any object, and generally, we use shell with plane, plane has no thickness by default. To make it looks good you can make rod to hang it because it's not a Ladin's curtain. You can also make rod by making box. To render the curtain simply press F9, if you want a realistic view, I will suggest you to use V-Ray, V-Ray is also plug-in of 3DS Max. Ok so this is the upper part of the curtain, in my next video I will show you rest of the curtain. Thanks for watching my video, subscribe to my channel of more stuff.